lovely to see you. Lovely very nice. See you. I, I very like. I like that we're dressed very similar in I, yeah. Hollywood black. Yeah. Yeah, it's nice. You I said I, you said I had nice soft hands when you came out. Do you think? No, I said aren't my hands soft? Oh, I thought you said I, my hands were soft. <laughs> Do you think my hands are soft? Yes. Yeah, they are kind of soft. I've not, I haven't done any real work for a long time. Well, yeah. that's Hollywood. Yeah. Have you ever worked uh, in construction? Or yes. Anybody? Have you really? I did. Really? Where? I was in, it was this summer after my senior, I, that's so funny, of high school. And I worked in Boston. We used to have elevated trains. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Way back in the 80s. You know, I, I've been to Boston. I was in Boston recently. Yeah, and in I, Boston, I, probably. Yeah, yeah, I thought it would be finished by now. The big dig? Yeah, I mean, oh. it's like one of the oldest cities in America. They're still yeah, building it. I mean, yeah, that's bad. Uh, I think there may be some corruption in that. You thing. think? Maybe. I don't know. Yeah. There are stories about cement trucks literally leaving the big dig and just going to people's houses and paving their driveways. Really? Yeah, just leaving. Well, I don't know why I don't live there. I love that. <laughs> yeah, you, you're from Boston? Yeah. Uh, Boston do, you, do you eat the chowder? Yeah. Oh, I love the chowder. Yeah, very good. It's like a fish latte. It is. Yeah. <laughs> So you listen, you like worked on a construction clam site, latte, a clam really. latte? Yeah, latte. <laughs> I don't even like, I don't like the sound right. of that. Um, uh, now, what's the, uh, what was the construction site? What did so you work on? I was, uh, right this summer before I went to college, I got a job, because they were re removing the elevated trains and putting in, in a subway. Right. And I was a laborer, and it was ho the horrible, most worst job I've ever had. It was really Worse hard. than ER? Yeah. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> that was, no, that must be bad. It was, it Do you bad. like it working in the ER? Because, you know, there's a lot of blood and pretending there's to be a doctor. There's a lot doctor of blood and pretending, but I didn't have to pretend to be a construction worker. I had to be a construction worker. Oh, no, no, so no. that's no. why it's hard. Did you actually work? Because you yeah. can get jobs in construction. And not work. Yeah, That's yeah. true, but yeah, I did work. Yeah, you can, yeah. But that's... on the ER, <laughs> I, I didn't work sometimes in the afternoon. Right, yeah, yeah. yeah. We would just hang out. What will you do when you finish with the acting? Are you moving into politics? Your dad's a politician. Yeah, yeah, was not anymore. All right, okay. He was a politician. Would you Would you like to be a politician? No. Why not? I mean, I, 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 I it's too hard. I, it's It's too hard. Really? Yes. You think? I don't know. I, you just lie to a bunch of people. It seems easy to you me. You just what? <laughs> lie to a bunch of people. Yeah, you just tell people stuff they want to hear. Yeah, you watch out, and I'll be the man, and everybody goes, oh, all right, and I then that's, that's it. That's true. <laughs> that's true. And you just have to avoid prostitutes and crystal meth. And like oh, well, in that case, it's out. It's out, then. It's out. Well, he wasn't a politician. If I don't get me my hookers and meth, right. I can't relax. <laughs> that's actually more the clergy's problem <laughs> than the politicians. That was a big the thing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, no, that, are you a like very religious person? Am I very religious? Yeah. No, absolutely not. No. Really? I was raised uh, religious. Uh, in what? In Cath what? I went to you Catholic school. Catholic school. Yeah. Oh, did, you, did you did you have a uniform? Yes. <laughs> so, uh, <laughs> you uh, still got it? I do. Yeah. <laughs> Guys ask you that all the time, don't they? If they find out you went to Catholic school, they're like, ooh, the uniform. Yeah. That's true, but yeah. you know, it's, it's probably, it's based in something. Cause you, you it's get, based you on where like I come from. It's a crazy. kilt, it's just shorter. Yeah, you know? exactly. Yeah. Right. When I, you know, when I would wear the full Scottish rig, people think I'm a very hideous Catholic schoolgirl. <laughs> <laughs> the kilt and the socks and the, you know, paint my face blue. There you go. Yeah, yeah, that's fine. Can I tell you a story about my Catholic school? Sure. My high school? Yeah, yeah. is yeah. it rude? Is it rude? Yeah. Um, no. It's, you it's can't ridiculous. Tell well, I'll tell you what. Uh, hold, hold on for a second, because yeah. we got to take a break, and then okay. tell me after the break, okay. all right? All right, stay tuned. We'll be right back with Maura Tierney, everyone. Welcome <laughs> back, everybody. I'm here with the lovely Maura Tierney. That was News Radio. It was. That was a lovely show. That Dave Foley was Dave. I love Dave Foley. He's me my too. friend. Me yeah. too. He's my friend, too. And really? He's so young. Yeah. yeah, yeah, we Dave looks very, very young there. You look exactly the same, oh, Dave. Yeah. That's a very appropriate response. No, I, <laughs> I'm nothing if not a gentleman, okay, madam. Good. So listen, you were going to tell me a story about your Catholic school that yes. was dirty, a, a dirty it's story. It's not dirty, it's absurd. All right. there, was, there was all girls that wasn't that dirty, really. Okay. Well, could, I guess it could have been. But, um, well, in, the, in my head it my, is. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> my ninth, tenth grade biology teacher told us uh, that you don't have to have sex to get pregnant. 
Hello. That's what they yeah. taught us in, in really? school. Really? Yes. Well, I guess, you know, th there's one woman that didn't have to have sex and have pregnancy. That's but, uh, yeah, but the, other than that, I think, that you know, was like there's not been a school. lot. Uh, yeah. Right. Well, now you can. Now you well, How can you? Well, you know, you can put it in a dish or whatever. Oh, like, so I it's see. Sort of yeah, like yeah, a yeah, yeah. Genius, yeah, yeah. Really, no, I don't, I don't know. I, I, uh, I'm a much, I'm a traditionalist. Uh, <laughs> I... I believe very strongly in shagging. I think that... Yes, thank you, everybody. I, uh, I do. I do. I, I, I think if God had meant us to use turkey basters, he would have, you know... Based, based, remember yeah, the basics. Yeah, yeah, Start out yeah, yeah. with basting and come back to basting. Yeah, yeah. How are you doing with the, uh, the celebrity poker? You do all that, don't you? I did it the one time. You did it the one time? And I did f fabulously well, but I, it was bizarre because I, I won, I mean, I won the whole thing. I won it. all you, this money for my charity, which was great. Well, how much did you win? $100,000. Holy crackers. Yeah. Yeah, that's a lot. Yeah. 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 It was great. Yeah. But I, I don't, I, it was like the god of poker was with me because I didn't really, I practiced for a week, but I don't really play. I'm bad at poker because I feel guilty if I win and I am angry when that's I lose. That's kind of interesting. What do you mean you feel sport? guilty when you win? I Talk I to me about this. When did you first start feeling guilty? <laughs> when you... Because I'm, I'm not aggressive that way in terms right. of like, but on the game I was because I didn't know anybody. What makes you aggressive? What makes you angry? When do you get aggressive? <laughs> Not angry, angry, but just kind of like, ah, like that. Kind of aggressive. Like what? Like, ah, like that. <laughs> um, poker? Poker. Do you no, get I'm losing? I never, I, never, I never get... You don't I, get angry? Never, no. What about when you're driving in L.A.? Okay, then I get angry, I mean, yeah, yeah. Do you not scream your head off? I do, you actually. eat the steering wheel? Yeah, I, I was actually driving, my son is, is, is five, and I was driving with him, and he now says, uh, the minute he gets in the car, he says, everybody else is a bad driver, Dad. And I'm like, it's amazing, you, you know this. So I yeah. don't know where he picked it up. Yeah. But, uh, He's a bit astute, yeah, observant. Yeah, he, yeah, he is. Yeah. Do you have any kids? No. No, no, no. Would you like some? <laughs> What's that all? A nice thing. Do you come from a large family yourself? The three kids in my family. Yeah. My parents came from big families, but well, Irish. You know, there's, yeah. uh, there's a lot of a uh, lot of them. Shagging. Sh yeah. Irish yeah. shagging. Yeah. Whiskey and shagging. Exactly. Yeah. And Whiskey potatoes. shagging and potatoes. Yeah, you can't go wrong. Do you still enjoy uh, potatoes to this day in LA? It's hard to get a decent potato here. It's hard, and it's also like a sin to have a potato in this day and age. I know. I hate that. Yeah. Carbs. Yeah. But yeah, yeah. Sure, I'll secretly eat a potato every yeah. day. <laughs> I eat them raw. That's, I eat them. Do. I do. I that's eat them raw. Fun. Yeah, oh no, it's great. Really? Yeah, I eat them raw out of the ground. <laughs> I, I, I you have this. Only your teeth. Oh, using only my no teeth. Hand. I plant them in the garden and then I go in and go <laughs> like that and I eat them. Wearing the kilt. Wear, wearing my little Catholic schoolgirl outfit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's right. Well, listen, good luck with the ER. Do you think it'll stay on the air or not? Um, it's going to be on for sure this year and next year, and then who, who knows? We're, we're going to be like Bonanza. It's, it's like the longest-running show in the history of doctor uh, yeah. shows. Yeah. I, something. Yeah. Do you know anything about medical stuff? No. Uh, <laughs> that's all right. I know nothing about talk shows either. I could, I could probably either. stitch up. If you had a, a cut, I could probably stitch it up. Um, it would look terrible. You'd have a bad scar. Yeah. But I could do it. Well, uh, maybe if you have you got a cell phone? Yeah. Well, if I ever get a cut, just phone a doctor, and I'll and I'll wait. Okay. All right. It's very nice to meet you, the Marty and everybody. We'll be right back. I'm Lindsay Buckingham. <laughs> Please welcome the lovely Mara Tierney, everyone. Mara Tierney. I just, I, I, I didn't put anything unpleasant in your drink, yeah, by right. the way. No, I didn't. I'm... No, you can. You have to have a sip. All right, I will. <laughs> <laughs> it's fine. There's nothing wrong with it. All right. Help yourself. Hey, I like your hair. Thanks. I just said it when you come out. Well, I just thought, I like your hair. You've had it done, haven't yeah, you? Yeah, well, it's a different color, I think, since. Oh. It was, it was blonde for many years, now it's brown. Well, I, I think it's oh, kind of nice. That's you. a good look. And I like your... The shiny top. Thank you. I think I've got pajamas like that, you know, that kind of material. Yeah. 
It's comfortable. It is comfortable. Yeah. It's very comfortable. If you I have... I can't tell if you're ragging on the top or you're liking the no, top. No, I'm not ragging on the top. Okay. I'm not ragging on you. Okay. Why would I rag on you? Okay. I'm talking. What, what was? Yeah, I don't know. Just name nothing. Did you just take off a, it's an elastic a band? band? Yeah, around my. Why do you wear a rubber band? Do you have the OCD? No. Well, no. <laughs> I've got it terrible. Do you? Oh, I do. Oh. I have the OCD all over the place. I have to, you know, it's just I have to touch things twice. Do you want this? Do I want that? Yeah. I don't think that's going to help it much, is it? <laughs> Yeah, I could put it on something. There's a quit smoking thing that that does. Is that a quit smoking? Oh, yeah. if you want a cigarette. You're supposed to do that, which I, I don't know how the hell that's supposed well, to Well, I think it'd be better if you did this. Yeah. <laughs> if you smoked it, yeah. it went up. Exactly. Are you trying to quit smoking? Yes. How long have you known? I this? can't even discuss how long I've really, been trying to quit smoking. It's really hard. It's hard? Yeah, no, I did. I, you, did you smoke? I did smoke, yeah, I used to smoke. Did I you? smoked. I stopped when I was 34, 10, oh, 11 maybe years when ago. I turn 34, I'll stop smoking. Yeah, too. that's what you should do. <laughs> How dare you laugh? <laughs> no, I, I had a real hard time because, like, when I gave up drinking, it was, it was, like, it was a lot easier than giving up smoking. Said that to me. Yeah, because you give up drinking, you know, you lose weight, everyone goes, hey, you can stand, all that kind of stuff. <laughs> but you give up smoking, you, like, you put on weight, you get cranky and everything. People you hate You cry it. a lot. Yeah, yeah. Oh, I cry no, I a lot when I drink. Do you cry a lot? Yeah, hard, it's horrible. Really? Yeah, at work, nobody knows how to deal with me. So oh, like yeah. action, I start weeping. It's just well, that's hard. good. I, I, actresses that cry get Oscars. Well, that's true. Yeah. <laughs> just well, gonna I'm go. Be continually <laughs> quitting smoking for my whole career. And uh, you should put on an English accent. You want to get an, Ox an Oscar? Uh, cry in an English accent. <laughs> what pussy? I'm so upset. <laughs> Boom, Oscar. For the woman too, that works. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> No, it's true. Now, do you still get nervous coming on this show? You were very nervous the last time. I did get a little nervous, yeah. But you know, nervous. But I yeah. had some Hollywood water before I came on. Ah. Yeah. And I, I had a mini quiche. You have lovely mini quiches in the green I room. I love the mini they're quiches. They're good. Yeah. So you know that would help it ease them. No, they're to great. And what I like about the mini quiches is when I hold it, my hand looks huge. <laughs> He's like, look at the size of my hand. This is a regular size quiche. Oh, bow down to me, quiche lovers. No, it's nice. I mean, are you still having a nice time on the ER? Because you've been on it for a while. Now. I've been on it for a while. Yeah. And I am having a nice time. I mean, I'm almost done. So. Are you ready to quit? Yeah. Really? Well, leave. Leave. Move on. Move forward. How long have you been doing it? Eight years. Yeah, that's a while. So it's yeah. a long time. Yeah. yeah. What are you going to do afterwards? Um, I'm not going to go to med school. No, I don't know what I'm going to do. <laughs> I don't know. I have no idea. Why don't you go on a road trip or something? I might do that. I d I've done that many times. Have you past. really? Yeah. I used to do that I a lot. I drove all over this country. Really? Where have you been? Times. Have you been to uh, every, Chesterton? Every state. Except every like single Kansas. state? I've not been to Alaska. But I've been everywhere. I um, mean, I've been everywhere. No, I'm kidding. No, no, no. <laughs> have, you been, have you been to Florida? Yeah. Have you been to Delray Beach? No. That's a great place. Really? Yeah, yeah. Have Delray you been Beach. to Mount Rushmore? No, I haven't. That's amazing. Is yeah. it really? I nice? love that kind of stuff. Niagara Falls, Mount Rushmore, those kind of iconic. Yeah, you know, I, quite, I heard that Niagara Falls is a bit cheesy now, though. Is that right? Not from the Canadian side. Hey, of no. course, it's yeah. not cheesy in Canada, you know. Are you, are you Canadian? No. No, but you have Canadian sympathies, uh, clearly. Yes. <laughs> well, in as much as I, you know, don't mind the passive aggressiveness of the entire country. I... In, no, and also you're friends with Dave Foley. Yes. He was a lovely Canadian. Yes. He's he lovely is very Canadian. nice, isn't he, Dave he's Foley? Nice. Bit passive aggressive. Yes. Yeah, no, he has it. That, that, that's a Scottish thing, by the way. They learned that from Scottish oh, people. Oh, really? Yeah, and you know when Canadians say a boot? Uh huh. That's, they and learned pasta? that from Scottish yeah. Oh, they did. They're yes. Scottish people. But the bacon, that's all theirs. Okay. <laughs> Good to know. I like Canada. I like it a lot. Have you been to Montreal? Yes, but many, many, many years ago. Oh, it's fantastic. I like Nova Scotia. They speak French. Yeah, whatever. No, no, it's I'm... fascinating. They speak French, but kind of not real French, kind of a weird French. Like... Yeah. <laughs> it's kind of like they're pretending to be ducks. Did you really take your mother to the Grand Canyon on crutches? Yeah, no, now That's as I think so about funny. it, I... yeah, it's not a very good thing to do, no, is it? I was trying to be a good son. It's like you tortured her. I, well, you know, I had to get her back for the first 20 years, <laughs> didn't I? <laughs> Did you like the Grand Canyon? I do like the Grand Canyon. I think it's... I didn't uh, kind of get it. I have to go back. Well, when were you there? Seven years ago. It's, eight. It hasn't changed much. I know, but I didn't get it. It's too big. Well, it's very no big. Perception. It's the Grand think, Canyon. I know. It's, it's not the old middle-sized canyon. You it's go, the Grand Canyon. And you're like, wow, that is big. Yeah. And then, I, then we left. Well... I don't know what else to do there. 
Can't you stay for a while and be overawed by the awesome power of nature? I barely not. I don't know. Are you, are you really going to leave ER? Yes. Are they going to kill your character? I begged them to kill my character. They won't. So what are you going to do? Just go, become a... Of, the ending is very the Grand charming Grand. and sweet. Oh, yeah, she's going to go to the Grand Canyon. She's going to go to the Grand Canyon. Yeah. I'm sorry I have to go to the Grand Canyon. <laughs> my character is going to love the Grand Canyon. Um... Yeah, I'm just, I'm, yeah, it's sort of a sweet ending with me and the guy that plays, uh, Gorn, who plays Mike. Oh, oh hey, there were other cast members were on this show. This Yes, Ed Parmenda's been here. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah. John? John has been here. Who's, <laughs> who do you like? The, what? What's that all about? Stevens, John Stevens yes. has been here. I'm like, oh, they, they, oh, they, 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 yes, yes, Stevens has been here many times. It felt like a lot of times. It's probably only once. Oh, really? Uh, yeah. Just, <laughs> and, um, yeah, they, they all come over here. Yeah. Do, do you go on with them? I just want to know who's... Do I what? Do you go on with them? I found them not very pleasant, most yeah, of them. Yeah, me too. I, That's I, why I'm, I'm leaving. They're no, very nice. Too. No, we get on great. Do you all kind of live in the same house like the monkeys? No. <laughs> But we do hang out a lot. <laughs> well, that's nice. Yeah. Well, like you're going to the monkeys. <laughs> you're go, you're going to miss them when you. I will miss them terribly. When you yeah. go solo. Yeah. Yeah, that's but a shame. Be that. sad. Well, but you'll still come back, even though you're not an ER, right? Come back to where? To here. Hopefully, I'll have some other jobs. I hope to. Well, yeah, yeah, yeah. It's about. a show business. You might it's have your true. own talk show. I might just be drinking the show business water <laughs> <laughs> and not ah, actually be, be in show business anymore. No, that's all right. We gotta we gotta go to some commercials. Do you want to do you want to come back some other time? Yeah. All right. To. Come back some other time. Okay. Mara Tierney, everybody. <laughs> I'll be back in uh, eight months. And... <laughs> can never get rid of him, can you? <laughs>